Aircraft electrical systems. Question, some electric motors have two sets of field windings wound in opposite directions so that the answer, motor, can be operated in either direction. Question, one purpose of a growler test is to determine the presence of answer, a shorted armature. Question, electric wire terminals for most aircraft applications must be what type? Answer, ring. Question, what is the principal advantage of the series wound DC motor? A answer. High starting torque. Question, if a generator is equipped with a vibrator type voltage regulator, the actual time the voltage regulator points remain open. Answer, depends on the load carried by the generator. Question, what is the cause of generator brush arcing? Answer, low spring tension. Question, what is required when operating two aircraft AC generators in parallel? Answer. Frequency and voltage must both be equal. Question, the starting current of a series wound DC motor in passing through both the field and armature windings produces a answer, high starting torque. Question, which motor would be most likely to have an armature break? Answer, landing light retraction motor. Question the, question, the method most often used in overcoming the effect of armature reaction is through the use of Answer, interpulse Question, the only practical method of maintaining a constant voltage output from an aircraft generator under varying conditions of speed and load is to vary the Answer, strength of the magnetic field Question, the pull pieces or shoes used in a DC generator are a part of the Answer, field assembly Question, how many cycles of AC voltage are produced in a six-pole alternator of the revolving field type for each revolution of the rotor? Answer, three Question, if the reverse current cutout relay contact points fail to open after the generator output has dropped below battery potential, current will flow through the generator armature Answer, opposite the normal direction and through the shunt field in the normal direction. Question, how does the magnetic brake used to stop rotation of an electric motor armature operate? Answer, a friction brake is applied by a spring and released by a magnet. Question, in a generator, what eliminates any possible sparking to the brush guides caused by the movement of the brushes within the holder? Answer, the brush pigtail. Question, a series wound DC electric motor will normally require. Answer, more current at low RPM than at high RPM. Question, the type of electric wire terminals used for most aircraft applications, in addition to providing good current carrying capabilities, are designed primarily. Answer, to prevent circuit failure due to terminal disconnection. Question, aluminum wire must be stripped very carefully because. Answer, individual strands will break easily after being nicked. Question, the commutator of a generator. Answer, changes alternating current produced in the armature into direct current as it is taken from the armature. Question, an ammeter in a battery charging system is for the purpose of indicating the. Answer, answer rate of current used to charge the battery. Question, which of the following is not one of the purposes of interpoles in a generator? Answer, reduce field strength. Question, to test generator or motor armature windings for opens. Answer, place armature in a growler and connect a 110V test light on adjacent segments, light should light. Question, what is the color and orientation of the position lights for navigation on civil airplanes? Answer. Left side red, right side green, rear aft white. Question, to what depth is the mica insulation between the commutator bars of a DC generator undercut? Answer, equal to the width of the mica. Question, a voltage regulator controls generator output by. Answer, varying current flow to generator field coil. Question, which type of DC generator is not used as an airplane generator? Answer. Series wound. Question. What is the most accurate type of frequency measuring instrument?
Answer. Integrated circuit chip having a clock circuit. Question. During ground operation, aircraft generator cooling is usually accomplished by. Answer. An integral fan. Question. What does a rectifier do? Answer. Changes alternating current into direct current. Question. What type of instrument is used for measuring very high values of resistance? Answer. Megometer. Question. When a diode is checked for an open circuit or a short circuit, it should be. Answer. Disconnected from the circuit. Question. When handling a high voltage capacitor in an electrical circuit, be sure it. Answer. Is fully discharged before removing it from the circuit. Question. Which of the following is most likely to cause thermal runaway in a nickel cadmium battery? Answer. Excessive current draw from the battery. Question. How can it be determined if a transformer winding has some of its turns shorted turns shorted together? Answer. The transformer will get hot in normal operation. Question. Which of the following are the major parts of a DC motor? 1. Armature assembly. 2. Field assembly. 3. Brush assembly. 4. Commutator. 5. Pole piece. 6. Rheostat. 7. End frame. Answer. 1, 2, 3, 7. Question 1. There are three basic types of DC motors, series, shunt, and compound. 2. In the series motor, the field windings, consisting of relatively few turns of heavy wire, are connected in series with the armature winding. Regarding the above statements. Answer. Both number 1 and number 2 are true. Question. What is the appropriate method for installing pre-insulated terminal lugs and splices to electric wires? Answer. Using a crimping tool to secure the terminal lug. Question. Which of the following factors must be taken into consideration when determining the wire size to use for an aircraft installation? 1. Mechanical strength. 2. Allowable power loss. 3. Ease of installation. 4. Resistance of current return path through the aircraft structure. 5. Permissible voltage drop. 6. Current carrying capability of the conductor. 7. Type of load, continuous or intermittent. Answer. 2, 5, 6, 7. Question. When selecting hardware for attaching bonding connections to an aircraft structure, which of the following should be considered? 1. Mechanical strength. 2. Allowable power loss. 3. Ease of installation. 4. Permissible voltage drop. 5. Amount of current to be carried. 6. Type of load, continuous or intermittent. Answer. 1. 3. 5. Question. How should the splices be arranged if several are to be located in an electrical wire bundle? Answer. Staggered along the length of the bundle. Question. What is the minimum bend radius for an electrical wire bundle? Answer. Answer. 10 times the outside diameter of the bundle. Question. When approved, splices may be used to repair manufactured harnesses or installed wiring. The maximum number of splices permitted between any two connectors is. Answer. 1. Question. Electrical connectors used in aircraft assemblies should meet which of the following specifications? Answer. Military specifications, MS. Question. The most common method of attaching a pin or socket to an individual wire in an MS electrical connector is by. Answer. Crimping. Question. The pin section of an N slash MS connector is normally installed on. Answer. The ground side of a circuit. Question. The voltage output of an alternator may be regulated by controlling the. Answer. Voltage output of the DC exciter. 
Question, if several long lengths of electrical cable are to be installed in rigid conduit, the possibility of damage to the cable as it is pulled through the conduit will be reduced by Answer, dusting the cable with powdered soapstone. Question, grounding is electrically connecting a conductive object to the primary structure. One purpose of grounding is to Answer, prevent development of radio frequency potentials. Question, what is normally used to bond non-continuous stainless steel aircraft components? Answer. Copper jumpers. Question. Aircraft fuse capacity is rated in. Answer. Amperes. Question. When adding a rheostat to a light circuit to control the light intensity, it should be connected in. Answer. Series with the light. Question, circuits that must be operated only in an emergency or whose inadvertent, acti inadvertent activation could endanger a system frequently employ. Answer, guarded switches. Question, if one switch is used to control all navigation lights, the lights are most likely connected. Answer, parallel to each other and in series with the switch. Question, oil canning of the sides of aluminum or steel electrical junction boxes is considered to be. Answer, a shorting hazard. Question, electric wiring installed in aircraft without special enclosing means, open wiring, offers the advantages of ease of installation, simple maintenance, and reduced weight. When bundling open wiring, the bundles should. Answer, be limited as to the number of cables to minimize damage from a single electrical fault. Question, during inspection of the terminal strips of an aircraft electrical system, it should be determined that. Answer, the terminal studs are anchored against rotation. Question, what protection to wires and cables does conduit provide when used in aircraft installations? Answer, mechanical. Question, which of the following should be accomplished in the installation of aircraft wiring? Answer. Locate the bundle above flammable fluid lines and securely clamp to structure. Question, if the plus terminal of a voltmeter is connected to the terminal of the source voltage and the terminal of the meter is connected to the plus terminal of the source voltage, the voltmeter will read. Answer, backwards. Question, when using the voltage drop method of checking circuit resistance, the Answer, input voltage must be maintained at a constant value. Question, the nominal rating of electrical switches refers to continuous. Answer, current rating with the contacts closed. Question, aircraft electrical junction boxes located in a fire zone are usually constructed of. Answer, stainless steel. Question, to help minimize radio interference a capacitor will largely eliminate and provide a steady direct current if the capacitor is connected to the generator in. Answer. Answer, parallel. Question, the primary considerations when selecting electric cable size are. Answer, current carrying capacity and allowable voltage drop. Question, the navigation lights of some aircraft consist of a single circuit controlled by a single switch which has an on position and an OFF position with no additional positions possible. This switch is referred to as a answer, single pole, single throw, SPST, two position switch. Question, electric circuits are protected from overheating by answer, fuses. Question, how should a coaxial cable be routed? Answer. As directly as possible. Question. Which of the following copper electrical cable sizes should be selected to replace a number 6 aluminum electrical cable? Answer. No. Question. In installations where the ammeter is in the generator or alternator lead and the regulator system does not limit the maximum current that the generator or alternator can deliver, the ammeter can be redlined at what percent of the generator or alternator rating? Answer. 100. Question. Which statement relating to electric wiring is true? Answer. When attaching a terminal to the end of an electric cable, it should be determined that the strength of the cable to terminal joint is at least equal to the tensile strength of the cable itself. Question. Bonding connections should be tested for. Answer. Resistance value. Question. 
What kind of switch should you install in a single wire circuit that required the switch to be manually held in the on position? Answer. Single pole, single throw, SPST, two position normally open, and O. Question, a circuit breaker is installed in an aircraft electrical system primarily to protect the Answer, circuit and should be located as close to the source as possible. Question, how should a voltmeter be connected? Answer, in parallel with the load. Question, a circuit protection device called a current limiter is essentially a slow blow fuse, slow blow fuse and is designed to be used in Answer, heavy power circuits. Question, if it is necessary to use an electrical connector where it may be exposed to moisture, the mechanic should. Answer, use a special moisture proof type. Question, which of the following are considered circuit protective devices that are used in aircraft electrical systems? Answer, circuit breakers, fuses, and current limiters. Question, if a wire is installed so that it comes in contact with some moving parts, what protection should be given the wire? Answer. Pass-through conduit. Question, in the American Wire Gauge, AWG, system of numbers used to designate electrical wire sizes, the number assigned to a size is related to its. Answer, cross-sectional area. Question, what is the voltage drop for a number 18 copper wire 50 feet long to carry 12.5 amperes, continuous operation? Use the formula VD equals RLA. VD equals voltage drop. R equals resistance per FT equals 0 0.00644. L equals length of wire. A equals amperes. Answer. 4V. Question. What is the purpose of the selection of derated switches for known continuous load current applications? Answer. To obtain reasonable switch efficiency and service life. Question. What is the advantage of a circuit breaker when compared to a fuse? Answer. It is resettable and reusable. Question. What is the advantage of a current limiter? Answer. It will take overload for a short period. Question, what should be used to protect wires from chafing when they must pass through bulkheads, firewalls, ribs, etc.? Answer, suitable grommet. Question, in aircraft electrical systems, automatic reset circuit breakers. Answer, should not be used as circuit protective devices. Question, a certain switch is described as a single pole, double throw switch, SPDT. The throw of a switch indicates the number of Answer, circuits each pole can complete through the switch. Question, when considering an alteration, the criteria upon which the selection of electric of electric cable size should be based are Answer, current carrying capacity and allowable voltage drop. Question, what is an important factor in selecting aircraft fuses? Answer, Capacity matches the needs of the circuit. Question, the circuit breaker in the instrument lighting system protects the Answer, wiring from too much current. Question, one advantage of using AC electrical power in aircraft is Answer, greater ease in stepping the voltage up or down. Question, why are the iron cores of most induction coils laminated? Answer, to reduce the effects of eddy currents. Question, certain transport aircraft use AC electrical power for all normal operation and battery furnish DC electrical power for standby emergency use. In aircraft of this type that operate no DC generators, the batteries are kept charged by. Answer, rectifiers which use the aircraft's AC generators as a source of power. Question, the voltage in an AC transformer secondary that contains twice as many loops as the primary will be. Answer, greater in the amperage less than in the primary. Question, if the positive field lead between a generator and a generator control panel breaks and is shorted while the engine is running, a voltmeter connected to generator output would indicate. Answer, residual voltage. Question, what is a method used for restoring generator field residual magnetism? Answer. Flash the fields. 
Question. The major advantages of alternating current AC over direct current DC is the fact that its current and voltage can easily be increased or decreased. Answer. By means of a transformer. Question. Which of the following must be accomplished when installing an anti-collision light? Answer. Install a switch independent of the position light switch. Question. The inductor type inverter output voltage is controlled by the Answer. DC stator field current. Question. Question. When using an ohmmeter to check the continuity of a generator field coil, the coil should Answer. Show very low resistance if it is a series field coil. Question. The strength of the core of an electromagnet depends upon the material from which it is constructed and which of the following? Answer. The number of turns of wire in the coil and the amount of current, amperes, passing through the coil. Question. A voltage regulator controls generator voltage by changing the Answer. Resistance of the generator field circuit. Question. The overvoltage control automatically protects the generator system when excessive voltage is present by Answer. Opening the shunt field circuit. Question. When DC generators are operated in parallel to supply power for a single load, their controls include an equalizer circuit to assure that all generators share the load equally. The equalizer circuit operates by Answer. Increasing the output of the low generator and decreasing the output of the high generator until they are equal. Question. What is the maximum amount of time a circuit can be in operation and still be an intermittent duty circuit? Answer. Two minutes. Question. The most common method of regulating the voltage output of a compound DC generator is to vary the Answer. Current flowing through the shunt field coils. Question. Refer to figure 18. Which of the batteries are connected together incorrectly? Answer. Three. Question. Question. Refer to figure 19. Upon completion of the landing gear extension cycle, the green light illuminated and the red light remained lit. What is the probable cause? Answer. Short in the up limit switch. Question. If any one generator in a 24 volt DC system shows low voltage, the most likely cause is. Answer. An, answer, an out of adjustment voltage regulator. Question. How can the direction of rotation of a DC electric motor be changed? Answer. Reverse the electrical connections to either the field or armature windings. Question. Static inverters are electronic devices that change DC to AC with the Answer. Use of an oscillator. Question. Aircraft which operate only AC generators, alternators, as a primary source of electrical power normally provide current suitable for battery charging through the use of Answer. A step-down transformer and a rectifier. Question. During inspection of an anti-collision light installation for condition and proper operation, it should be determined that Answer. The anti-collision light can be operated independently of the position lights. Question. Major adjustments on equipment such as regulators, contactors, and inverters are best accomplished outside the airplane on test benches with necessary instruments and equipment. Adjustment procedure should be as outlined by Answer. The equipment manufacturer. Question. A battery generator system provides direct current. On installations requiring alternating current from the battery generator system, it is necessary to have. Answer. An inverter. Question. An aircraft electrical circuit control relay is. Answer. An electrically operated switch. Question. The purpose of a rectifier in an electrical system is to change. Answer. Alternating current to direct current. Question. What is the ratio of turns between the primary coil winding and the secondary coil winding of a transformer designed to triple its input voltage? Answer. Primary will have one-third as many turns as its secondary. Question. In an AC circuit with no phase lead or lag, which is true? Answer. Real power equals apparent power. Question. How are generators rated? 
Answer. Amperes at rated voltage. Question. How is a shunt wound DC generator connected? Answer. Both fields are shunted across the armature. Question. The poles of a generator are laminated too. Answer. Reduce eddy current losses. Question. What is the frequency of an alternator dependent upon? Answer. RPM. Question. Where is the generator rating and performance data located? Answer. Stamp on the generator data plate. Question. Residual voltage is a result of magnetism in the Answer. Field shoes. Question. In troubleshooting an electrical circuit, if an ohmmeter is properly connected across a circuit component and some value of resistance is read. Answer. The component has continuity and is not open. Question. CSD-driven generators are usually cooled by. Answer. Oil spray. Question. A CSD unit drives a generator through the use of. Answer. A variable hydraulic pump and hydraulic motor. Question. Integrated drive generators, IDG, employ a type of high output AC generator that utilizes. Answer. A brushless system to produce current. Question. If the integrated drive generator, IDG, scavenge oil filter is contaminated with metal, you should. Answer. Remove and replace the IDG. Question. When necessary during operation, CSD disconnect is usually accomplished by. Answer. A switch in the cockpit. Question. A CSD unit that is disconnected in flight, due to a malfunction such as over temperature, may be reconnected. Answer. Only on the ground by maintenance personnel.